practice the past few days um, since the Monday game. Uh, so I think that carried over into this game, and we just have to be consistent with it. What about for yourself? Just you know, you struggle a little bit with your shot, and I see you were sick. So just just to get a night like this where everything seemed to be going in. Yeah, it felt good. Obviously, to see the ball going. Um, you know, I haven't been feeling too well. I didn't. My first practice back was yesterday. Um, so I'm, I'm slowly getting back to myself. Uh, but it feels good to be able to have a game like this tonight. How many practices did you miss? Oh, well, I didn't practice the two games before at Oregon. Okay. Yeah. So he had mentioned that you, I guess it was the day before Oregon, you were at practice and he said that you were practicing it at Oregon. So you're feeling, starting to feel like yourself? Right now? Yeah. Yeah, I'm like just now getting back. But I'm still like low-key drained. Uh, it was my first time having the flu, so I didn't really know how much it affected your energy. <laughs> but I'm figuring that out now. Um, no matter how much I sleep, I'm still tired. But it is what it is. I'm just going to have to just let it run its course. It doesn't help test on top of it, too. Exactly. But luckily, today is Friday. Tomorrow Saturday, and then I can get some rest. Any chance that the time away from the court actually helped you find your shot? You know, like kind of hit your reset button? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean... Yeah, uh, possibly. Uh, I mean, it, it felt good to get some rest. Like, nah, I didn't want to obviously get the flu, but, right. you know, we've been going since August. Uh, so it, it felt good to get my body some rest a little bit. Coach said when you play better defense, you, it turns, makes you better than offense. Yeah, he said that before the game, and I was really thinking about it, and I think he's right. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, Coach is always right. Um, Believe it or not, he knows a lot more about myself than I do. Uh, so, yeah, I have to bring the effort every game on defense, and that gets me going to transition. So, yeah, I need to listen to him. <laughs> what was the uh, shakeup in the starting lineup like with uh, Anna sliding into a starting room? What was the shake up? Yeah, well, how did it feel uh, to have a little bit different uh, starting lineup after having the same one for? So Didn't long? Anna start at the beginning of the season? Yeah, briefly, yeah. and then it was. Uh, yeah, so I, I mean, we need to be interchangeable, anyways. If somebody comes off the bench, it, it, the flow needs to be the same. So, I mean, I practice every day with her, so I, I don't really know the difference. Yeah. For her to be able to kind of do what she did today, I mean. If, 11 assists. Yeah. Um, how much does it kind of change like the, what this team can do when she's out there being able to just facilitate so well? In addition to, you know, <coughs> you and yeah. Crystal. Uh, she sees the floor really well. Uh, it is great that she brings other things than just uh, scoring and shooting the three. So, yeah, we need that. Um, getting people open, we need that on our team. So, kudos to her. <laughs> Can you talk about the difference in intensity between the way you guys played on Monday and then the way you practiced and played today and how to carry the, this forward? Yeah, um, I, that, Monday's game, I, we were just embarrassed. I mean, it's embarrassing to, it was just embarrassing. So we don't want to feel that again. So we're trying to figure out any way possible to do things differently. And Coach has really put emphasis on bringing energy and our effort level to a different level. And so the past few practices, we've really been bringing it. <laughs> so it just carried on to today. And we just need to be consistent with it and keep it going for the rest of the season. So how do you translate what happened today to playing the number one team and they're building 18,000 fans screaming and still have that confidence, still have that intensity? Well, how we played on Monday is not how we play, period. So... Whatever we did today, we're going to do tomorrow in practice and on Sunday, and we're going to be prepared for the game on Monday. And we're going to play UConn basketball, and we're just going to be in, in a fun environment on Monday. I think you were talking about this a second, but when, when you have Anna out there um, mm -hmm. making passes like she was making today, which some of them were like, I didn't see that, <laughs> but nobody, yeah. nobody sees it except for her. Mm. What does that do for this team to have an, another almost point guard out there? Yeah, um, it's great. 
I didn't. I don't know if I talked about this, but it's great to see her have the one or bring the ball up the floor because it gives Crystal a break. She doesn't have to do it the entire game. Um, running the point is kind of difficult, so Chris, kudos to Crystal. But anyways, um, it helps a lot her getting assists and doing other things and just scoring because we need that on our team.